Hello everyone. So today we are going to be reviewing a mask. It is right here. We're going to be reviewing the Glam Glow Insta Mud 60 Second Pore Refining Treatment Mask. So the packaging looks like this. It's really cute packaging. Pretty sure all of y'all have seen this. But I want to see if it like, I don't expect it to work 100% but I feel like it should work pretty good. So we're going to test it out and see how it works. So it says to um, smooth a generous layer onto dry, clean skin and do not rub in. Um, let sit and the mask will transform into oxygen bubbles. Leave on for 60 seconds. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I'm just going to open the packaging. So cute. I love when they leave little things. It says hello sexy. Super cute. Okay, so this is it. Basically, this part says everything that was on the front of the box. So, let's see if it tells you how much to do. This is a generous layer, so. It says use it two to three times a week as desired. So, let's do it. So, I'm going to go ahead and get my timer ready for 60 seconds. Well, I'm just going to do the stopwatch, so. I'm going to start it once I start putting it on my skin. Okay. Okay, so I'm about to start my stopwatch. I don't know if I should start it before I start putting it on or after. We're just going to leave it like ready. So we can start it whenever. So it's on my hand like this. And then put it all over my face. I have heard this dries kind of quickly. So I'm trying to put it on super quick. And again, like I've said in the video, my bigger pores are around my nose. Okay, it's starting to dry. Y'all can like, I don't know if you can hear it. Okay, are my, okay, like I was saying, my no, my bigger pores are in my nose area. I'm like literally putting a lot. Um, so I'm going to pack it on my nose area for sure. Oh, let me start the timer. Okay. It's like drying on my hand too. This is pretty quick. I wish it would like wait until you have it like set on your face, but I'm pretty sure that's not like a real thing. I don't think they can do that. Whoo! It's like tingling. Like, I don't know if I ever. Eee, I don't know if I like that because it's like you want to itch your face and you cannot. Okay, it's like bubbling up. You can see. Oh. My big pores are. I need it like all right there. Okay. Okay, so it's bubbling up. 47 seconds, 48, 49 so far. Uh, Y'all, I swear I'm the worst at putting mask on. Like, either I get it all over my eyebrows and everything, or I completely miss it. Y'all, this is itchy really bad. Okay, it's been over a minute. I'm gonna wait a few more seconds because I did not have it all over my face in time. But anyways, it looks pretty cool. It's like bubbling up and stuff. Still, it's still tingling. If y'all don't like this tingle feeling, do not try this. Okay, five more seconds. You can hear it too. Okay, so it's been a minute in like almost 60 seconds, I'm not 60, 40 seconds. So I'm going to go ahead and take this off. It's really, really, really tingling. It's still tingling and bubbling, but I'm going to take it off because it like literally I want to itch the crap on my face right now. So I just have a washcloth and just wiping it away. Y'all can like hear the foam. It's pretty. I like that sound. Okay. And also, I was, I thought I would do this today because I'm not going to wear makeup today. It's like super rainy where I am. Um, and the weather is just honestly awful. And so today I'm just going to be running errands and just with maybe con some concealer on and stuff like that. So I wanted to see if it really gave my skin like a good like feeling and stuff and made it look good. Because I feel like on days that I don't wear makeup, this could probably be like nice to just put on if it really does only take you know, make it your skin better in 60 seconds, put on some concealer, maybe mascara, and then go on with your day. 
So I thought this would be good to try today. Um, and if it does make your skin look good, then it definitely will be good to use this in the morning and then start your makeup routine. So, all of it is off. Um, let me see, like, if it's even made a difference. Okay, so, I don't... Oh, honestly, it looks the same. I think y'all can probably agree. Um, I mean, my skin feels really soft. Like, literally, it feels really soft. So, and I love having soft skin. I touch my face having, like, when my skin's really soft, which I shouldn't do, but I do. So, I really like that. Um, I don't know. My pores are really big over here. Looking at them, I don't believe that it really made them any smaller. That's for my nose ring, but. So, I don't know. It did make my skin really soft. I don't really think that it made my pores smaller at all. But, that's just my opinion. Okay, so my camera did die and I do not have a backup battery yet. So, my camera was charging for about 10 minutes and um, I haven't done anything else to my skin. And honestly, y'all, my skin... Oh, I have no hair. My skin is like super smooth i would say that it did not do anything for my pores but i do feel like it made my skin like super soft so i'm definitely just gonna wear them like bare face today um i'm gonna put like on the rest of my skincare and then i'm maybe put on some concealer but that's about it so i definitely did like this mask i think it's cool for like maybe to do in the morning and then do your makeup i don't think that i will do it all the time but i do think it's like was a cool idea and it does make your skin super smooth if y'all do try it out, be sure to let me know down below um, how y'all liked it. It does tingle a lot, so if you do not like tingling, do not try it because it tingles a lot. So let me know how y'all like it um, or if there's any other products that y'all would like for me to try. And I will see y'all later. Bye!